Rob, I'm excited about this Sunday. It's, uh, you know, we've been not in here for a while. Let's, let's talk, what's going on Sunday? Well, there's going to be an opportunity for people to come and to be here. Uh, in fact, we have wrestled with this, talked at it through with the administrative board, and that is having this wonderful possibility of Sunday of having people come be here in prayer and hear some wonderful live music. And I'll let Luke say a little bit about the details. Of that. Yeah, so on this e-news below, uh, you'll see links to Sign Up Genius, uh, to sign up online. Uh, we're we're gonna have folks spaced distance throughout. Uh, we're gonna have different time slots that people come through. You'll see that when you sign up. Uh, we're gonna set up the sanctuary in such that everybody will come in through the handicap entrance on the uh, left-hand side of the chancel, uh, sit, have time of prayer and listen to music, and then exit. Um, uh, we do ask that if you have any symptoms to please uh, stay at home, and, and we're sorry for that. We, we know this is a strange time. Uh, we'll also have sheets uh, for sign-in, uh, just so we can do contact tracing, just in case someone were to, we were to find out later someone was sick. The main thing, though, is we're excited about having this space where we can all come and, and pray. And, and this will be happening this Sunday and Wednesday. And the following Wednesday, and the sign-ups are below uh, this video in the e-news. But that's the Sunday afternoon. Right. Sunday morning, we'll be back live with worship. Yeah. What, what are we talking about this week? We got special music again. Four of our youth. Oh yeah, it's gonna be great. Two instrumentalists, two solo vocalists, vocalists. will be offering the music. Uh, of course, Corey will be leading us, and the sermon is uh, this wonderful, humorous moment in the middle of the Sermon on the Mount. Called humorous because I think Jesus certainly had a little bit of uh, his tongue in his cheek <laughs> when he talked about why should you bother with the speck in somebody else's eye when you have a two by four in your own eye. Yeah. So it's a. It, it challenges us to look at what does it mean to be a Christian community. This uh, community is not known for, for judging, for being censorious and critical, but helping everyone to be a part of the healing and power of work of Jesus. We also have a special announcement on Sunday. You're going to want to tune in and see this uh, about a, a new staffing position. And so, uh, you know, we'll just leave that dang one out there. You're going to want to tune in and right. see that. Uh, excited about uh, the story on Sunday and we just look forward to seeing everybody. God bless you all.